Hello everyone, this is Jim Ogrzynski with your weekly lecture video. So this week I will briefly talk about the upcoming Future of Everything essay that is due on Sunday the 4th. Um, as I mentioned here, it builds off of your work for the discussion boards uh, 2 and 3 on the two articles about chat GPT and AI. So this is a short essay. It's two to three pages. I say about 750 to 900 words um, to do an adequate conversation about artificial intelligence. You're probably going to be closer to 900 words. Um, now I'll give some guidelines here. So um, I'm not looking for an introduction uh, in a short assignment like this. I don't want to waste any time uh, reading some sort of an introduction. I want you to get right to it. I say here in bold, no introduction required or, or wanted. Get right to the summary of the two articles is what I'm looking for. Uh, whatever order works for you, one then the other. Um, and remember the lessons and the information from the art of summarizing. Important to understand how to go about making uh, others' uh, words yours uh, by reading carefully. Uh, and summarizing the main points of their particular articles. Now, I'm going to be um, kind of like, um, you know, a uh, guideline here would be about a third to maybe a little less than half of the word count should be summary. I am looking to assess your ability to A, summarize and keep it brief and to the point. And then at the same time, flipping over to the next part of the uh, essay assignment here, is to respond to the articles. I want to know, do you agree, disagree? What do you think? And I offer some questions here about education in the workplace and AI. You can roll back to some of your thinking from the discussion board posts. I don't know if copying and pasting from the discussion board post would be appropriate, but you should have some of the information that you um, have that can expand on your uh, uh, writing of the essay here. So I'm looking for you to support your critical thinking with evidence from the information provided in the article. So your source is the two articles here. And I do <clears throat> clearly state that if you want to use outside sources, which I'm really not looking to really read in this particular essay assignment because it is so short, <clears throat> you must provide both in text citation and the works cited page since it is two subject articles here um, you don't have to give me any citations for the two subject articles um, I know what they are they're my articles I provided them for you in this assignment and the discussion boards so that is not necessary if you do um, do some citation on there um, please um, you know that is that, that is appreciated then but uh, remember, in writing summary, you always have to give credit to the uh, an attribution to the author of that article, or T states in her article, blah 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 blah. So according to Shanklin, blah blah blah. blah. So you want to be able to even in summary delete, determine and attribute who the speaker is. All right, so that's important there. You want to be able to determine. A lot of people wrote really great summaries in the discussion boards. Um, so I want uh, everybody to think about what they've done there and how it can carry over to this particular activity. Shouldn't take too long to write uh, this particular essay. Um, and as far as submitting that assignment, let me go right here. You can go in a couple of places. It's, uh, the assignment is in the module. Here's the submission here. Okay, you will upload a document here, either a Word document or a... Um, PDF works fine for a document. It's a file upload. No links to Google Docs or anything like that here. So I want to make sure of that. Also be aware that uh, if any of you use Pages um, um, in the MacBook and Pages, you should download that as a PDF and then upload it here to convert that. We do not have capacity to uh, open uh, page documents here. All right. Okay, that's about it for this particular essay. I'm looking to get some assessment of where everybody is as far as um, responding and summarizing the skills that we will need to move forward in this course. All right? As always, if you have any questions or issues, send me an email. Good luck.